ain't no other way Throw them coins up, the coins up if you initiate it Shout out to the tats up on the wall cause they don't really make the studio what it is Real as it ever gets Shout out Aquaman and in the flash too Uh, shout out Virgo King, he the man too Yeah, shout out E-Man, fuck it damn too Uh, hey, it's Jody's Corner Yeah, hey, it's Jody's Corner Uh, yeah it's Jody's Corner. It's the place where you wanna be. If YouTube was good, it's your boy Jody Joe. Welcome to Jody's Corner. We in the building. I'm Jody Joe. Thank you guys so very much for being here. And we officially managed to hire the man, the myth, the legend, the code. I have arrived. Let's get it. The code is working full time for Jody's Corner. Yes. I don't mm. just take the money for myself. Mm. Took the Give money and I some. hired my friends. Give me some. Spread that love. You know what I'm saying? That's what friends do. This is going to be the Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie review with some spoilers in there. Sorry about that. That's a little bit too big. Forgot to do that last it's bit. Love it. Let's do that. Uh, this is going to be spoilers. Spoiler free. Yeah, you always spoilers uh, with these. Sponsors have chosen us to review this. Members of Tier 1 who are able to choose uh, movies, uh, members of Tier 2, who are able to choose up to two movies to, for us to react to each month. So if you guys want to be a member of Jody's Corner, go ahead and click down below and join Tier 2 status. Thank you guys so very much for being members. Because your memberships is the reason why I'm able to hire the code. That's the only reason why that was able to. The next person that we're going to hire, because I'm not done, I'm sharing the wealth. The next person I'm going to hire is Marvin X Files, man. So guys, if you guys want... Get your perks, tier two. You could vote for your dedicated video. You could choose topics on Jody's Corner. You could vote for movies for us to react to, watch, and review just like this one. Or you could even vote for a whole season of television for us to watch. Tier one, you could vote God for damn. a whole TV season for us to watch and review right here on Jody's Corner. That shit hurts when you say that shit. Right? So yeah, long. Depends on the TV show. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Here we are, man. So, listen, 2003. This one has Jessica Biel in it, and that booty is like, whoa. She wears these jeans in this bad boy, and you're like, yeah, I see why you a celebrity. All the way from 7th oh, Heaven. Oh. To here. Yeah, she got the butt. She got the butt in that motherfucker. I like stomach, but that stomach was on point, guys. Stomach Damn. is on point. It's very sexy. Oh, that stomach was on point. There's a scene where the guy falls. He's like, help me up. He's grabbing all on her butt, bro. I'm like, look at this creep. Freaking weirdo. Yeah, 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 yeah. But Texas Chainsaw yeah. Mask, y'all know this movie, man. This movie right here is, uh, this was like the... I don't know. This might have been the fourth or fifth Texas Chainsaw that's Massacre of, movie. This was like a remake. This was like the remake Another version. Then they remade it again and again. It's always retelling. A retelling of the story. But I'm going to tell you, I think this is the best retelling of a Texas Chainsaw Massacre I've seen. This one is really good. I like them all. I haven't seen the ones from the 70s. I haven't seen them like all the way through, but I've seen and I like them all, well, but this I'm one's like special, man. man. I'm like D-Man, so there's know. something special about this one, though. I like a good. I'll never forget movie. this movie. Okay. How grimy and dirty the town was. Whoever did that art, <laughs> that that middle place in Texas, this ghost shaggy, forgotten shit about weird. town. How do you have a town of houses where people live, a family lives, and there's no sh no police, like just just nothing. There's yeah. no other humans. <laughs> there is, but they just far apart. Ain't nobody there. That town was <laughs> empty, bro. Maybe it wasn't even a town. Yeah, everybody was, left sometimes. They, yeah, they know, got up out of there. Too many oh. people leave. Population oh. four. <laughs> bro, man, the movie starts over with these kids on a field trip. These kids are going to a concert across country, and they stumble across this girl who's just out there wandering, stranded alone on the road, and they stop to help her out. She's yeah. Bad talking mistake. gibberish. Big, Bad mistake. Big mistake. I'm sorry. Hey, look, if mm -hmm. you stranded on passing, no. I'm sorry. I'm not doing it, bro. You're not going to stop? I'm not stopping. Oh, not man, stopping, that's bro. tough. I mean, you play The Last of Us? Yeah. In the opening? Yeah. Uh, family on the side of the road? We're not stopping. They got a kid, Joe. He didn't stop, We're though. We're not stopping. He didn't stop. He could have stopped and saved them. We don't We're know. We're not stopping. That's me. I'm just saying. I ain't got Why you got to be so heartless? Bro, because I want to live. <laughs> that's why. Right. Play that shit. You were right on this one. Because had they not stopped, they'd have been alive. Yeah, it'd have been cool. That was Jessica Biel's fault. She said, "Stop the car. Let me get out." Yeah, and then uh, yeah, yeah, they they consoled the girl. Like you know, they brought her on the van. Yeah, they had multiple the, opportunities to get yeah. out of town. Yes, they did. So. And the girl's like, "No, you're going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way." What? She pulls a a thirty eight special. 
She pulled a whole 38 special with the snub nose out of her vagina, <laughs> bloody and guts and everything, puts uh, it in her mouth and blows her brains back. She says, you're all going to die. Facts. And now, I, I understand the whole part about, let's let's keep it on, because at the end of the movie, Jessica Biel was in the same position. Yeah. And she was being dumb, too, but yeah. not as dumb as that girl, like. No, 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 she wasn't answering any questions. Like, if you just escaped a town where they're trying to get you, you would have flagged that van down, like, help me, help me, help me. Right, 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 right. She wasn't really acting as she should have, according to the story. Well, I, a little maybe, bit of a trick. Maybe there was, you know, maybe she was psychologically, you know, traumatized by the whole incident and shit. Who knows? Now, when they saw that she was going back towards the town, she said, you're all going to die. She pulled the gun out and blew her brains well, out. Well, she obviously wanted to get away, too. But yeah, yeah, I agree yeah, with right, you. Yeah. Her, her 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 actions was a little bit bizarre. Yeah, could have been for any number of reasons. Maybe she had drugs in her system. Who knows? But yeah, I'll give you that. You know, she maybe she was already on a uh, top speed mode and she was out of gas. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> Who knows, bro? Because these people are sick. Like yeah. when you running, bro. The 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 chase in this movie, I'd be like, God damn. My heart would be just be like, bro, my shit. If I was running from that dude with that chainsaw, bro, I'd be like, bro, hey, look here. I'd be running like a slave. <laughs> God, like a I slave. I would have been gone. There would be no fence I wouldn't be able to scale if I'm hearing him behind me. You know that, that run where you don't look back? You don't, yeah. You keep running uh, either until the noise stop or you see somebody that you think you can trust. Right. <laughs> that, so... Somebody you think you could trust, kind of like, you know, this guy here. <laughs> this guy makes this movie, point blank, period. He is the lifeblood. He's what makes this movie uh, ultimately eerie. He is scary as... Wrong thing, sorry. <laughs> Where the sorry. heck is the... Oh. He is scary as shit. <laughs> Better watch what you're doing, son. L I mean, look at that butt. Hold on. You see that? You see that butt? Hold on. Look at that thing. Oh, that was a dude. But anyway, still. <laughs> it was her, bro. It was Okay, yeah, I know. It was her. You're right. It was her. Dude was in the car. I mean, look at that thing. Golly. <laughs> that sheriff, nasty, disgusting. He was the Thanks, Ma. Iron in my pants. Thanks, Ma. <laughs> sheriff, they're living a hillbilly evil motherfuckers, bro. So it's a family of six sadistic. What is their end game here? You're just there's here no to end kill. game. There's no You're end just game. there to kill people that there's come no past through your town. No and the mom is a nasty hillbilly, yellow, big, fat, disgusting. Y'all making fun of my Jimmy or whatever, making fun of my boy. I know, I know your type. She's like, please help me, save me, help me. And the people are just ignoring. It's a big mystery at first. Like, what's wrong with this town? And then you figure out later as the movie progresses, they're all, <laughs> it's all connected. Right. That's the uncle, that's the mama, that's the brother, that's the right. son. Oh, my Everybody's gosh. Involved. And then you have this little boy that looks like a raccoon with with yuck mouth. Right. Remember the little boy? He he actually had some decency within him. The, I believe the kid was for that girl. What do you Maybe mean? not, but. For the girl? Yeah, I think she had that boy. I think she was there for a while, bro. They said you're all going to die. Oh, she, you think that that was the son of, of her? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe. The boy was concerned for the girl, though. That's why. Right, so, right, or, right, right. You know, or maybe they would just, because the, they weren't trying to uh, uh, just kill her, kill her. Because when the boy asked if she was okay, I was like, why would he ask that? You know what I'm saying? So she might have been there with him, and they were torturing the shit out of her. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The boy showed concern for the girl. So that's why. I was like, what the, what, the, what does that mean? What what? They don't just kill people. Like, they kill some people, torture some people, have fun with some people. Like, what the freak is going on here? They're just twisted. So, you know. But, the, yeah, I thought that was the, 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 the chick's kid. And that's why he wasn't as evil as them, I assumed. Right. And he was, they were starving the shit out of that poor child. They treated him like a dog. You stay out there with them dogs. <laughs> that's what I'm saying, You bro. can't come in here until you learn how to act right. <laughs> I think he was for that chick. And then you had that old man with the no legs and shit. <laughs> Yeah, y'all can make a phone call about how not you. Not you. Just her. He went in there and copped some serious feels, bro. <laughs> Golly. I understand he, why Justin Timberlake said, come here, baby. He used that um the handicap to his advantage. Yes, he did. I can't. I would walk. do the exact same thing. I'm touching you to get up. It ain't yep. no other thing be <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Lies. Boy, look at them cakes. Look at the yams, baby. <laughs> yams under that me. This was like the first white girl with booty before Britney Spears and well, Britney Spears really didn't have it, but she wore the right. 
This was the first official white girl with booty all the way from seventh heaven. She lost her booty though. You know, so. It's gone, yeah. She did it on purpose though. I think so. She's I'm pretty sure she misses it though too. Hell yeah. And that movie Summer Catch when she came out of the pool, bro. Oh. <sighs> yeah, go ahead and look that up. And Chuck and Larry. Go ahead. <laughs> She was in her panties in oh, the bra. Go ahead and uh, go ahead and look that up and thank us uh, later. That shit, bro. She was nice. She was nice. Yeah, yeah. It's always the buff ones, bro. She's she c- wasn't buff. She she was kind of buff, just like she had shoulders. Yeah, like what's her name? A black chick. Yes, not as buff, not as buff. Yes. but you know what I mean. They got that yeah, little. Yeah, I know what you mean. The buff ones, bro. You like buff women? No. Yes, but you know, <laughs> too buff is a problem. I don't want no. Uh, what's the what's the chick's name? The, the uh, Ronda Rousey. No Ronda. No. I'll take Rhonda. No, no. Sorry. Okay. Just a little. Just a little. There was there was something really eerie about this movie, man. I remember being so like scared watching it. This was in 03, so I was about 17. I was really at the edge of my seat. I saw this in theaters too. Huh, so I, I was watching this movie in theaters and I was just I was I was kind of scared, man. I ain't gonna lie, watching this movie. It has the sound, the score, the 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 direness of it, the the kills. Yeah. They had Bruna hook. Hooked his body on there, and Jessica. Right, she was right. trying to lift him up off the. He, and then he she dropped him, and he crashed back down. And then he gave him a life to just kill me, like put the knife and kill right, me. Right, right. I would have slit his throat. You stabbed him in the torso. That made it worse. <laughs> but but I get it either way. Man, I mean, I mean, this is a, a good job this, with this that. story, the script, the the way the acting. It's the execution. That execution. Execution is important. That execution was on point. It made you, for me, the movie because ain't nothing really happening except mer- regular. Well, not regular, but insane murders of these cri- with these crazy people. What do you think makes this so special? What is it that made this different than all the other horror movies? Well, it's a, it's a multitude of things for me. Uh, it's the the fact that, first of all, the, the, the color palette is nice for the disgustingness <laughs> of these people. Like, <laughs> the color palette matches so beautifully. <laughs> like, you see water dripping and it looks filthy. It doesn't matter where it's dripping from. You see a little drip, whoop, that shit, oh, filthy as shit. That wasn't even the toilet, bro. That's just the sink, and it's ah. Oh. They, <laughs> they captured the nastiness yes. of this town. Yes, they didn't this care. This whole part of the planet is nasty. You don't see anything nasty. You can see somebody saying, oh, man, all the "Yeah," and that shit looked disgusting. <laughs> it's like what? How are you What'd doing you this? <laughs> what you do say, Colin? Go ahead. Yeah, bro. Go ahead. What do you say? It doesn't matter. What do you say? Somebody lean forward and say, "Yeah," that shit <laughs> looked filthy, bro. It's like what? Are we, What's going on here? That zooming in that nasty yeah. mouth. <laughs> they put makeup on their tongue and their teeth. Was orange, brother. It's so Skin. disgusting. They, she was wearing a moo dog. And then the people you're rooting for, like uh, uh, Jessica, uh, Jessica <laughs> yeah. Beals. Her character, all the all the kids, all the characters, they're all sweaty. Like they all have a sense of urgency. Like they look sweaty. Like they need a bath. Like, yeah, just dirty. It's like come on, what's it? that color palette and that filth was on point. This, this, it's like it's like this freaking sheet right here. It's like a orange, dirty, yeah, yeah. tinted. It's great. It's perfect. It's like, hey, it works so you well. see this place you're looking at right now? I bet you've used it here. You want to leave. Yep. Nothing's happening, but you, mm, you can man, feel I'm it. Out. You can feel and smell that place. Yeah, yeah. So that was good. Mm-hmm. And also they, they captured um, what also helps is that sense of hopelessness. Every time... Somebody like from it started with the chick in the van when she blew her brains out. She had that sense of hopelessness like you, you're all going to die. Like everything's I'm, I'm done. We're done. And then when they tried to get her to safety, then you saw the kid. I'm like, fuck. It's like they start <laughs> starving this kid. kid. I'm like, first, I'm, she had no hope. And I'm like, damn, you have no hope either. This little child. I think that little kid, that nasty little <laughs> nigga, that disgusting, <laughs> demonic-looking kid, bro, I think he was eating the, the corpses, bro. I think he was eating the corpses of the dead teeth bodies. teeth sideways. <laughs> those teeth. Bro, teeth those eye breakfast. sockets, my nigga. Need, the, <laughs> poor child. The, the makeup they use on that kid. The, yeah. the, bro, the costume design, yeah. makeup, and set design yeah. of this movie is killing, fantastic. It was killing that shit. Oh, my God. Yeah, bro, it's that sense of hopelessness. Wife beaters and shit, <laughs> stained up. Yeah. And 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 like I said, that hopelessness, it carries out throughout the film. When you see somebody being um tortured or chased, you feel like he about to get caught. Like I always feel like he about to get caught. Yeah. And when they escape, 
because of the way the movie is structured, I'm gonna catch him later. It's like <laughs> it's like it's so hopeless. It's just so hopeless. So when any for me anyways, so when anybody gets away, it's like I'm shocked. Really? No. You can get caught. You can get caught. This so movie also reminds bro. me really well of the power of the uniform. When that yeah, sheriff yeah. first arrived, yeah. you could tell something was wrong with him. He was all the way left field creepy, bro. He was. Looks like y'all blew her brains out, huh? <laughs> Whose gun is this? Huh? You talking to me? Oh, she's yeah, kind of, ah, uh, you got to wrap her around, son. Get get your hands all in the brains. Ain't nothing but brains and blood. Hey. Pussy. Hey. Oh, she's a little wet down. Yeah. You know, sometimes what I do, I like to cop a little feel, <laughs> see? He was grabbing her titties, the dead body titties. Oh, bro. she's a little wet down here. Which one of you guys took a few turns after the... Bro, I'm out of here, bro, my nigga. This, guy, this ain't no real cop, my bro. Nigga. I'm gone, bro. Listen, listen, when the cop showed up and he's making jokes, that's a that's a sign, right? But I would let that slide. Yeah. Because I'm a little goofy around, you know, yeah, tragedy, yeah. you know. So I would let it slide. But when he decided that other shit about he's wet and when he's cop in the field, yeah, yeah, yeah. When when he decided to have us help. We got problems. Yeah. Man, what the freak is going yeah. on here? I'm yes. a, you can call your, call your sheriffs or whoever you got with you, bro. You got civilians helping with this body. Something wrong he here. He took the gun she used to blow her brains out and put it in his ankle holster, <laughs> letting you know it's my gun. <laughs> and they still, like idiots, stuck around and watched and partook oh, in that shit of wrapping the Was body. Was that the same gun he put in that fool's mouth? Yeah, man. This is, hey, bro. He nasty. <laughs> he smelled the gun. <laughs> Whose is this? <laughs> Nigga, that shit supposed to smell like blood and hot pussy. You nasty sheriff. He smelled it. Oh, whose is this? Oh, shit. Nigga. Oh, shit. She's wet down here. He was filling her vagina. <laughs> oh, imagine how beat up it was. She stuck a gun up there. He didn't probably hit it so many times, but she was running from them. They didn't caught her, and she was trying to escape. So he, he knew her pretty well. <laughs> oh, my. It's terrible. But yeah, it's that it's that sense of hopelessness. Remember when yeah, he had you're the, right about that. When he had the gun and they whoever directed, I don't know, writer, whoever did this, it was a good job because he gave dude the gun and he was like, "Shoot me." Yeah. And when I first watched it, all I was thinking is he's not going to shoot him because yep. we need the plot to go forward yeah. and they're gonna regret it. But they made him shoot him. Like he pulled the trigger. Like, oh, we got ourselves a murder. Yeah. <laughs> like, God damn. <laughs> What the hell? I'm like, what's going on here, man? It's just one thing after the next of just hopelessness. Every time when old boy went missing, hey, and shit started popping off pretty fast in this movie. They did once, not. Bro, once, I say 15, 20 minutes in, bro. Yeah. They it, it was gone. Yeah, it once. Niggas was missing. That stupid boyfriend with the curly hair yeah, he and the trash. long chin, he <laughs> is garbage. He trash. Oh my God, he's the worst out of the bunch. Uh, the 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 nerd, he was a cock sucking player hating nerd. He was right, you know, right, right, right. Nobody was really g- a good character in here. Just no, got, just, yeah, they were just, just, Beale was good. They were trash kids, you know. They were doing their right. thing. They was doing their thing. Right, right. But it's this town, bro. They're still there, chilling, <laughs> waiting on the next one, freaker. Right. Not all of them died. Right. That's their that's their that's their thing, bro. That's their thing. They all get off on it, mom. We got any new fresh bodies? <laughs> Go on, check the refrigerator. There might be an arm or two in there or something you can eat on. Yeah. There are some. She's talking about, let's go have supper. There was a scene where it said, let, let them stay for supper. <laughs> I'm thinking to myself, what the freak are y'all eating? <laughs> what the freak are you eating? I didn't want to eat your right. supper. Right. I want nothing Whatever the freak you made for dinner, <laughs> I don't want it, my nigga. Right? Probably uh, rat stew. You, <laughs> you know that idea of filth where, where, <laughs> where you're in the bathroom? You're in the bathroom, like, not even in the bathroom, like, you want to go to the bathroom, and let's say you have, like, a burrito or a taco. Yes. You put that shit on the table so that shit can wait for you to come back. Yes. Because the idea of filth. Yes. If they made me a meal and that shit looks out of the ordinary, that shit looks like some shit from Olive Garden or some shit, nigga, this uh, surroundings, I'm not eating that, I don't care how beautiful it looks. I don't care how well prepared it looks because they just look filthy. You ever been to a nasty public bathroom? Yeah, they're all and local. you go to the urinals. There's piss and t- and dookie and toilet around, paper nigga. all in the urinal. You turn around. Then you go into the shelves and you go to the stalls and there's dookie and piss and yeah. just it's piss all around the toilet. Yeah, 
It's That's dirtier than that. It's like, lick, lick that floor, huh? Yeah. Lick that floor. It's still not dirtier than this freaking town, bro. Yeah, that's, that's the, yeah. It's oh, just, my God. It's like, you don't want to be there. Like, if the, if I was thirsty, going through that town, let's I don't want you, I don't want to drink of water. Let's keep going. You want to drink I'll water? be like, let's keep going. <laughs> you want to drink of water? I'm not thirsty No, I'm not, I'm not thirsty. Go, I'm yeah. gone. I'll drink my piss. Out of here. I, I'm good. That's we good. I'm let's feeling. go. I don't care how sparkly. You didn't bring the glass? That shit could be sparkling clean, crystal clear. It won't, though. Nigga ain't drinking that shit. Bro, this shit is terrible. <laughs> All in all, man, she, the, you know, it, it, the climax was cool. The payoff was great. You know, a lot Good of kills. There was, Good there was kills. some cliche up in here, cliche you deaths. Need them. You need them, bro. Uh, them, yeah, I guess. You need them. Yeah, yeah, you're running through the towels when you could just run around. I get it. I like that. that he was creative with scared. that chainsaw. He was scared. He was scared. He was taking faces and fingers and body yeah, parts. Yeah. I'm like, my, this is graphic. But all in all, this was a really good movie, man. And I'm glad that Tier 2 recommended this bad boy. Because I really, really always adored The Texas Chainsaw Massacre. A movie that I could still watch to this day. And personally, a movie that I would recommend, if you haven't seen it, to really watch this movie. I hate watching these movies. It's really movies. good. I like this movie. Yeah. I like them all, but I hate watching these movies. Like, especially this one. Why? Because it's it's so filthy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't like, like, I'm like... It's tight. Next. And hot. Next. Yeah, it's just... It's, it's filthy, hot, It's doing stinky, its job sweaty. too good, bro. Like, look at that poster. It's just oh, yeah. filthy. <laughs> it's so filthy. Bro, uh, for me, great time. I think that this movie really does hit on uh, all cylinders. It does. The the tension's there. The score's there. Characters are there. It's it's not, it's not It doesn't fall deep into the cliches of most slashers and most it horror movies. It, though, yeah. This yeah, movie, yeah. This movie is a film. This is definitely a film. This is not a summer blockbuster <laughs> Halloween movie. This is a film. It has some really good cinematic value, some good characters. Very eerie town. The town is a character itself. It's really, really creepy, and I really enjoyed this film. I give Texas Chainsaw Massacre an A. Oh, shit. Yeah, oh, I, I, can't, give it an a. I can't do that. A whole A, huh? I can't do that. It's an A. I agree with all, all the things you said, except for the fact that if the movie, like, I understand what it is because of, the 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 real life tragedy and all that stuff. So I understand where they were where they were going with this, but they they just they were like, freak it, this is just murder and death. Like that's what you're here for, and 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 they did a good job putting it to to film, but I give it a B plus because they did that well. That's not far from an A, homie. Yeah, I know, but I got to give it a... one notch below an A. I That's gotta a give good it a B grade. Plus because That's a good grade. It is I like a good that grade. grade. I, like, I like the movie too, bro. I like that grade. I give it a B plus because I understand about the massacre and they didn't... They the, Their motivations of the family, uh -huh. that wasn't a thing. Like, all these murders and killings that they were doing, that wasn't a... Don't even worry about that. You get what I'm saying? This is a movie that said, don't worry about why, don't worry about how this, this this town became so... Don't worry about any of that. Just know that when we get here, shit's about to go down. It's going down, bro. <laughs> so that's why I give it a B plus, man. It's going down. If it, if it had that extra oomph, I would for sure jump off a bridge with this shit, but you know, I had B plus, B plus. Because it's, it's enjoyable. Great, it's enjoyable. Oh, well, yeah, I like it a lot. I, I agree. Could agree more on this movie. Two good back-to-back -back movies for the month of November. Thank you, guys. Remember... Join the memberships. It's right there down below. Click the blue join button. Pick your tiers. Get your perk. Today we're doing a sponsors only stream for all tier four members. So shout out to you guys. Thank you guys so very much for watching Jody's Corner. We are two parts of the Just Us League. And we out this thing. Deuces. Told you that we leave it. And don't forget, join memberships. Check out the Patreon if you like anime and Squid Game. The next person that's going to get hired to work full time for Jody's Corner along with me and the code. It's Marvin X Files. See you next time. Subscribe. <laughs>